Oh, basically, me and my girlfriend uh, get home from a trip to uh, Denver, Colorado. We get home and uh, we notice one of the ceiling panels are down in our bedroom, which has happened before. We had, we had a raccoon enter, enter the, uh, the residence that one, one time before, so we kind of knew what had happened. Uh, put the towel back, uh, looked around, figured it went back out the hole. Uh, didn't see it anywhere, so we continued throughout our night and just uh, ended up just going to bed. And we were awoken by uh, our dog barking very ferociously at the window. And it turns out it was uh, the raccoon. It was it was in behind the window shade, in between the, the window pane and the, and the shade there. And uh, I tried to uh, force it into a uh, a. Uh, a shoebox didn't really work very well. I was kind of still a, a, a little sleepy, and uh, I eventually shoot it into our bathroom where I trapped it in there for uh, for about an hour. We we uh, wrestled and I tried to uh, get him into a uh, duffel bag wearing snow gloves and a, a big snow jacket that I, I had just had in my underwear. And uh, I, I finally, after a, a few a uh, little bit of blood, sweat, and tears, we got him into the duffel bag. And, uh, as I exit the building, go to Luckily Raccoon and go outside so we can not be in the house. Uh, the beer truck coming to deliver beer at the bar was just sitting there kind of looking at me very, very weirdly in the snow jacket and my underwear and letting a raccoon out of a bag. And yeah, it was kind of like a, a very good way to start off my day, I guess.